Hello there. Um, today we are going to tie the fly uh, tailor by Skarpien Bjarnason. But the tailor is uh, an all Icelandic fly. And it's a nymph. And it's uh, been around here for a few years. Not too many... I'm not sure if no, too, too many anglers today or fly fishermen know about the fly. I'm not sure about that. But... Uh, this fly is considered as, considered as a really good fly for trout fishing during the uh, season here. So we'll pick a hook number hook size number 10 with a straight uh, leg. We'll attach the uh, thread to the hook shank. And uh, <clears throat> for the body of the fly we will be using uh, a brown Aurora yarn. And we will be wrapping the body with uh, golden wire as well. So first of all we have to place the brown iron yarn on the hook shank and make the body out of it. Like I'm doing here, I'm trimming, just trim the end of the, of the yarn. I use only two stripes of the Aurora yarn, they come to all together in a six stripe uh, band, but two stripes is enough for this size of the fly. It's uh, number 10. And we place that there. Then after that we will just attach, attach a thin golden wire to the shank. And this is rather thin wire. You can use like a medium, uh, the thickness of a medium uni wire I'm, I'm using there. But the, the one I'm using on at this fly is small and it's relatively kind of, you know, it could be done with a medium wire as well. So the next uh, step after this is to create the body of the fly with the aurora yarn and we wrap the uh, aurora yarn around the hook shank just uh, tight enough so it's not going to be sliding off and we have to leave a space close to the head for the thorax or the front body of the fly like there you see that i'm attaching and uh, and securing the outer yarn down there you see the space from there to the head of the fly that will be done with like we'll do another wrap there a little bit thicker then we'll wrap the golden wire around and that's uh, yeah, an important. It plays an important role in the fly. It gives it a, gives it a look, it a little bit shinier look, and it also strengthens uh, the body. Now we will lock the wire down with a few firm uh, wraps, and the wire is then just trimmed off with my uh, wire scissors. And then again, we have to. Uh, make the uh, make the thorax but before we do that there is a back on the fly that goes over the thorax at last and that will be tied with like a kind of like a sand brown look or like a light brown uh, tone of an aurora yarn you see how much lighter this yarn is than compared to the one we are using for the body we'll just place that down like this and it it stands back like there. We'll just make it like this. Then we'll take the rest of the body out of the yarn and wrap that over the over the rest of the shank and until the head of the fly. And remember, we have to make this like tight, and this is supposed to be like a little, like a slightly thicker than the body of the fly. And then we just simply secure the uh, simply secure the yarn down like this, trim off the end, and, and then you'll make the back of the fly with the light aurora yarn, and that is simply done like this, and it's supposed to be on the middle of the top as much as possible. Then we'll just securely and clear, carefully lock it down. So we are not creating like a too big of a hat on the fly. As you see, it's a nymph. It must not be with like clumsy hat on it. And then you'll just wrap this down, form the hat. 
and simply leave it like this. We will just do the whip finishing job with the whip finisher knight right now. To do it two times, feel more secure with it. And just add another knot there, and it's gonna definitely gonna be staying in place. Um, then we'll just trim off the thread and. The only thing left is to give the uh, fly a little bit of a, a little varnish, a little coat of varnish on the on the hat and on the knot. That's all there is, guys. We'll just yeah place the varnish on with the needle, and the only thing I have to say more is to to simply thank you guys for watching. You may subscribe the channel if you like and. Place a like on the video and share this video around the internet as much and as often as you prefer. And I'll, I'll see you guys in the next video up and running. And if there are some special requests from you guys about some flies that I could tie, just leave that in the comments below. So thanks a lot and take care and see you in the next video.